was talking about, right? So the spot, getting it on the exact spot that the kicker marked, okay? The tilt, the, the, each kicker's different. They all prefer a different type of tilt that they want forward or to the side. And then also the strings, making sure the strings are pointed to the target. A lot of that has to do with the snapper. So if the snapper snaps, what we call a 12. If you're looking at a clock, 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6, 9. But if you ever snap, if a snapper ever snaps a 6, that's like the cardinal sin in snapping for a field goal because now the holder's got to work and he's got to get the laces all the way around. But typically, it's just a fine movement. We prefer 1 or one o'clock or 11 o'clock for the snap if it's not a 12. So he gets it down and then turns the strings how he wants them for the kicker. But all that's predicated off the kicker. So that's uh, kind of how and what we're looking for. Again, soft hands have to be able to take command because you are the quarterback of the field goal unit. Uh, and then also a guy that has athletic ability. Cooper, so you guys have paid attention. We like to yeah. operate, run a couple fakes every now and then. I was just going to say, I mean, Cooper DeGene, that seems like a would be a huge luxury if you could be your holder. I don't know how, could you have a lot of, I mean, I guess you have a lot of say in that, right? Like, if you want him there? I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> the head coach, well, that's what I'm saying. He's the, he's, the final, uh, he's the final veto power, but I think with Cooper, he's an exceptional athlete, right? We all saw what he did in high school, right, yeah. with the ball in his hands. Um, I think that, that part, right, that we all saw him as a quarterback. Okay, now you look at him as a holder. I promise none of you guys paid attention to him as a holder in high school. Yeah. Maybe it should be. I don't think anyone did, because I barely did, so I never missed it. Anyway, my point is that you know he has a unique ability with the ball in his hands, and I think that's part of that's part of that position. Again, it's a position most people don't think about or don't think about. Everyone blames the kicker for a missed kick. Well, if you go and you watch and you you really look closely, a lot of times he's either off the spot, the tilt is not what the kicker wants or what he expected when he's striking the ball. Well, everything we're trying to do with kicking field goals is trying to compress the ball, hit the sweet spot the way kicker wants to. Is that it something like, you want? Uh, it seemed like the uh, communication with Colton Rastetter and uh, with Keith especially was so ongoing that they were almost in, the same, in tune with what they want to do. Is, you, is that a little bit too high for a new holder to go in with a, with a kicker or do you think that they have the potential to kind of hit that same sweet spot? I definitely think they have the potential to do it. It, it takes reps, right? It, mm -hmm. takes, uh, it takes constant communication and it takes chemistry. So those are the things that, that it takes for a, for a kicker and a holder to, and, a, and a snapper to work a clean operation. I promise you guys can all go watch tape now and watch, watch games and see. <laughs> you watch the NFL guys do it, it is, it's marvelous. It's unbelievable, right? Because it looks like the, the snapper snaps the ball, and bang, there's laces. We call it a dime. You're snapping a dime right to him, bang, perfect. Holder doesn't have to do anything but put the ball down. Uh, it's not like that all the way in college. But in high school, it's like, hard to watch uh, for me, a guy that's into it, right? But, you know, in college, there's more spinning and, and twisting of the ball to get the ball, to get the ball the way the, the kicker wants it. But going back to your question, I think there's chemistry that's involved. That's part of the deal with using a, a player that's not a, a, a specialist, right? Because they're, Cooper's off busy getting yelled at by Coach Parker. And he's trying to make tackles and interceptions and all that stuff. And then, oh, by the way, hey, field goal period, you're up. You know, so that there's, it's, it's not as easy doing it that way as it is working with a specialist. Keith and Caleb have held for each other in practice. They were two kickers, uh, they held for each other at one point, right? Because they felt the kickers knew who had the better hold and this is the hold I want. So it's just a, a fine little art that I knew nothing about as, uh, before I started coaching special teams. But now I see how it makes or breaks a, a, a unit and comes down to points. Would you like to have that?